All right, let's start with Arkansas at Auburn, Shane. This game kicks off at uh, 11 o'clock Central, noon Eastern on the SEC Network. Arkansas favored on the road, Shane. How about that? By three and a half points, over under 62 total points. Auburn has won six games in a row in this series. How about that? Last season, Auburn won 38-23 in Fayetteville, and Auburn leads the all-time series 19-11. And we got we even got a tie in there. They've been playing so long. So, who wins it, Shane? Well, you you get caught up thinking about how well Arkansas has been, you know, over a course of a season this year and last year. You know, obviously it's not been perfect this year for them, but you know, you you think Auburn would have been some of those losses, but no, you get Sam Pittman out here and saying he's never beat these guys. Mm -hmm. And so then you get to thinking like, well, can he beat them this time? And, and I think that's a loaded question because, you know, here you got Auburn. We got, we got kids leaving. We got, you know, kids. It's just, it's, it, it almost feels like the, the perfect storm every, every week, we're trying to get them, Brian fired, you know, but they, they still come out. There's still a lot of fight in the ones that are still there in the locker room. Mm -hmm. And and I don't expect that to go away during this game. I, I think that this is going to be a tough fought football game. I think there's a lot of pressure on this. I think Sam wants to get on the right side of the winning in the SEC. And I, and I think he wants to prove to everybody that he is legit coach that he's going to be around for a long long time and that you know last year wasn't a fluke and the start of the season wasn't a fluke that that they're really building something up there in Arkansas and, and I think Brian on the other hand is still fighting for his damn job and and I feel like some of these guys are doing it for him and, and so that's why I think there's a lot of pressure on this one because neither team can really afford to lose this game yeah. and, and keep up the momentum with with what they're trying to do down there on their campuses so I there's going to be no defense in this game. I tried to make it a a close ball game, but I really think that this comes down to who makes the mistakes on on that side of the ball. I, I think that if it, there's there's going to be a lot of yards, there's going to be a lot of points. That's why I kind of like your prize picks here. But the more I think about it, there's still one of the best quarterbacks in the country wearing that Arkansas uniform. And that's why I've got to stick with them Razorbacks. That being said, brother, I've got this score 38, Auburn 28. So give me Arkansas and the points. Mm. I like that, Shane. I like it a lot. Of course, Rocket Sanders leads the SEC in rushing 870 yards on the ground. How about KJ Jefferson, Shane? We already gave him a shout out. One of four SEC quarterbacks with – 1,400 passing yards and over 300 rushing yards. I mean, he does it all for them Razorbacks. Mm -hmm. But how about this, Shane? I didn't realize this. Auburn has scored 30 or more points nine times in a row against Arkansas. <laughs> now, I realize, you know, the history, maybe that doesn't play a huge factor in this matchup, but just something to consider. And, and here I, I got Tank's numbers here, 179 rushing last week or excuse me, two weeks ago when the, before they had the bye, two touchdowns. So he's heating up, Shane. And I didn't realize this, Robbie Ashford, mm -hmm. number four in the country, Shane, over 15 yards per completion. Now, mm. he don't have many, I guess, but the ones he is hitting, are, they're big plays. So, yeah, I think this is going to be a, a high-scoring affair, just like you said. But here's two things to, to really – Keep your eye on, Shane. Arkansas, when they have the ball, they're number 12 in the country in passing efficiency. Mm -hmm. Auburn, number 67 in the country, stopping the pass. So major, major advantage for Arkansas. But Auburn, when they are running the ball, they're 50 in the country in rushing efficiency. Arkansas, 115 <laughs> in stopping the rush, rush efficiency. So – this is going to be back and forth, back and forth. And it may come down to, Shane, the last team with the ball. This has been a funky series. Arkansas has won some of these games, but the officials cost them. I think something can funky happen here too, Shane. Last team with the ball wins it. Mm -hmm. But I'm going, who else am I going with, Shane? I'm going with them <laughs> Arkansas Razorbacks. But I think it's going to be a little bit closer than you, and I actually think it's going to be higher scoring than you. So I'm going Arkansas 
42, Auburn 35. So a touchdown game like the Hogs on the road, like the Hogs and the points. But anytime, Shane, you got an SEC team going on the road and they're favored, it's a dangerous, dangerous place, Shane, because this Auburn team has not quit. These fans have not quit. Brian Harson, believe it or not, has not quit at this point in time. So who knows? I, I would not be stunned if Auburn wins this football game, but uh, now nah, I'm sticking. Well, I'm sticking with the. Let Hawks. me ask you on that confidence here. Is you know we got uh, how many games total? Four, five, game, five games, mm-hmm. and you know out of the five games and that pick right there that you 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 gave, I would say for me. This is the fourth confidence I have as far as least confidence, you know. Mm. No, I, I am not. That's exactly I, where I am, Shane. Okay. Um, I don't want to spoil it, but I do have a Honda Morristown selection. So I that, do, too. That's the only one that tops it. <laughs> <laughs> I got one coming. So uh, I just think about this game, and this is the one that I, I, I really – you know, because you just want to pencil Auburn in four losses. This potentially four losses in a row. Yeah. You know, this is 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 Brian get fired after this game? I mean, the, the, it's the same storyline. Blah blah blah. But then you know you're you got the up and down Razorbacks, and and which one shows up? You know, is this the the BYU offense, or mm-hmm. you know, is this someone else? So I I think part of me is just the. the the further we go on this thing, the least confidence I have in Arkansas. And uh, I, I still think that there's a lot of fight with, with, with the Tigers here. And I'm just, I'm just not willing to, you know, wager this one up. I thought about it first, just picking Arkansas to blow this thing out. But then I, I, I convinced myself that Auburn hangs in there and could even win this thing. So least one of the least confidence games uh, in my opinion, but uh, should make for a hell of a matchup. Yeah, and adding another little layer of intrigue, Shane, both teams coming off a bye. So, yeah. you know, who makes the corrections? Arkansas desperately needed to get there because of their health, but mm-hmm. you have to think in the back of your head, the offense would have liked to keep playing. They were they were at such an elite level there against BYU, uh, but I know they needed a rest. But, hey, let's see if they carry that over two weeks having not yeah. played on the road. You know, it's no, it's no lock that they – just tear through Auburn's defense. You know what? <laughs> right. Absolutely.